Hey, what's happening everybody? My name is Harrison and this is going to be an Unreal Engine 4 tutorial on how to get the number of pawns in your game. Uh, there should be a GitHub link in the comments below if you just want to get the code and move on. But if not, uh, let's go ahead and continue with the video. Uh, let's go ahead and create a new class. New class, actor, uh, number of pawns. Or get number of pawns. Create the class. All right, so just created our class for us. Um, let me close out some old tabs. <clears throat> oh, we don't have to do anything in the header file. Header file. Let's move on to the CPP file. On begin play, let's get the amount of pawns in your game world. Uh, so the first thing we have to do is create a variable in 32 num pawns, and that equals <laughs> get world. We can use the get world function. You know, every actor has a get world function immediately available to them. A uh, get world branch off that and then get num pawns. Get num pawns. Yeah. And then return that. And so that's gonna give us the number we want, but let's go ahead and print that to the screen so we can visualize it. Um, so if G engine. So that's true, print it to screen. G engine oh, how do we do this? Um, add on screen debug method, add on screen debug message. Uh, negative one, let's visualize it for 15 seconds just for display purposes. Uh, let's make the color green. Green is a built into UE4. Uh, F string print F. We want to say number of pawns equals uh, percent s to represent that we're going to pass in a string. Or no, rather we're going to do a d uh, stating that we're going to pass in a number. Rather, did I miss something? Yeah, print f looked off to me. You got to do all capitals text. Put that there. Uh, wrap it. Uh, then uh, num pawns, right? Yeah, and that's going to equal to d. Now we have to close out all the functions. Do that. I think that's good to go. You know, I might put it one two. Three. Close out. All right, let's go ahead, compile it, and see if it works. All right, uh, let's push play. Up, oh, I didn't drag it in. Get number of pawns. Drag that boy in. Push play and it says number of pawns equals one. Let's go ahead and try to drag in another pawn so we can increase it. Pawn, empty pawn, default pawn, get number of pawns. Oh, that's my uh, pawn. There you go. Push play and now uh, get number of pawns equals two. So that's about it for this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.